62 men were found frozen, standing upright, buried under 30 feet of snow on Rogers Pass in Canada on March 4th in 1910, just hours before the men had been clearing the way for a train headed for Vancouver. Suddenly, the valley erupted with a roaring thunder when a massive avalanche broke free from a nearby mountain, slamming into the workers and hurling their 91-ton engine and plow 45 feet before it landed upside down and crushed the wooden boxcars. As rescue workers arrived at the scene, it was immediately apparent there were no injuries to treat, only bodies to recover. The 62 men had no time to react before the unstoppable wall of snow instantly buried them. The only survivor of Canada's worst avalanche was the fireman of the crew who was not cleared by the initial blast of wind, managing to walk away untouched.